Hi friends, so this video shows how to download and install MongoDB GUI Mongo Management Studio. Go to this URL and click on this uh, download. Then here we can see the community edition for one user. So click on this download. You can enter the mail ID if you want, otherwise click on not thanks. Then you can download Mongo Management Studio for Windows, Mac, or Linux. So here I am using Ubuntu system. So I need to click on Linux. And save this file. So I already downloaded this file. So let me cancel it. So this is the file which I downloaded. So just right click on the file and select extract here. Then open the folder, extract it folder. Then here right click on this file. 86 underscore 64 let's try it again then this question is going on please wait okay then open this uh, extracted folder then here you can see One folder named LX iPhone MMS. Open it, then open Electron. Right click on open, then you will get a Windows window like this. And here you can see the connect button. You can see by default it's trying to connect to this port 27017 okay let's click on connect you can put the server location here in my case it's local host and name Mongo DB one. There is no password. This new like database destination database no time out. So other things you can just leave it. Then let me click on test connection so somewhere it's uh, need to put the port so we need to we need to add like this to 27017 local host caller no okay connection test successful then click on save connection Okay, then now let me make it full screen. Now we can see the database which I created inside my MongoDB server. Let me go to this database MediaDB1. Inside that, you can see one collection. So these are the the documents in that collection you can see here if you right click on the DB you will get an option to add new collection you can drop the DB you can also rename the DB copy 
then if you right click on the collection you can do import export then here we can add new document you can click on this plus button and here you can enter the just uh, add so just type key value fair then click on save so that way you can add new document to the collection and you can also edit the existing document click on edit document and you can change the value see number of documents updated one so you can also delete a particular document just delete it you can do the bulk action like multiple selection then here you can do the deletion you can see number of documents selected So lot of options are here you can check it and view also you can change it this is table type view you can edit here So you can you can change it like this so different types of views are available you can use it this is actually a, looks like a good buoy okay I hope you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel please like and share the video if you have any doubt please uh, comment I will help you so here you can type the query and based on that query you can fetch the data fetch the, you can filter the documents and you can also load queries there's a lot of options